Hey guys, welcome to Pixels Design Studio. I hope you guys are doing well. Uh, today in the Affinity Photo, we are going to learn two techniques that is the masking and the clipping technique. Let's see what we can do with these two. First thing what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in a file and definitely open my image. This image is an Affinity Publisher logo uh, with the background. So what I want to do here is I want to crop the logo with a circular edge. I can do even a triangular uh, cutting. I can even do a rectangular cutting depending upon you know the tool what we select over here. The first thing what I'm going to show you using the ellipse tool. I'm going to select the ellipse tool and uh, just draw it over on my background using the shift key. Press shift key and just drag it so that we have the exact circle okay and I'm going to leave it then just to make sure that it's in the middle we can go in the align tool and you know align it center and align it in the middle and uh, after doing this I'm going to just select the ellipse layer and drag it over to my background layer okay now make sure that you drag it on the thumbnail of the background layer and just release it so we got this you know circular edge cutting over here this technique is nothing but the masking technique now if I want to export this I'll definitely go in the file first I need to select the entire layer I need to go in the file and export it uh, make sure you export it in the PNG otherwise in case if you are exporting in the JPEG then uh, the entire background will turn into white now currently I just want the logo and nothing else so I'll just select the PNG and select selection with the background option over here in the area section and say export okay I'll just rename it to logo and if we save let's see what we have saved now is this logo now if you open it using uh, using my uh, photos windows photos then uh, this is the logo what we have over here right now okay uh, so this was the masking technique we can attend the same thing using the clipping technique also so I'm just going to go in the layer and I'm going to place this ellip layer where it was before and now uh, we will go the other way around we're going to select the background tool and we're going to clip it to the ellip layer like this and we're going to expand and here you can see uh, the logo is actually kind of bigger and it is coming at the edge of the circle so we need to reduce the size of the logo so uh, we can unlock the background layer and uh, we're going to just select the edge of the background layer hold the control key and bring it you know inside so that we reduce the size of the logo now you can see that it is perfectly fitting inside the circle and you know the entire focus is on our logo so we can attain this using both the techniques using the masking and the clipping tech in case if you want to move the lip layer you can go around in the entire background space okay i hope you guys like this tutorial uh, make sure when you export it, uh, you export it in the PNG mode. Otherwise, you'll have this background uh, if you export in the JPEG mode. Okay, let me know how you felt about this video. Any information that you need to convey to me, any suggestion for me, please comment down in, in this video. And um, see you in my next video. Till then, stay safe and healthy.